you know, when I first seen the first alien statue or piece of uh, artwork from Mexico, my buddy tried telling me it was 10,000 years old and there was people researching this and it was true. And I laughed at him. There was no way I could believe that this stuff was, was coming out of the ground looking like this. There were so many things that contradicted everything that I'd ever been taught. And uh, so I began to ask questions three years ago. And uh, the questions have been asked by not just myself, but many, many collectors and people in the uh, scientific community trying to understand this. The parts of Mexico that it resides in are very dangerous. This here is found right near the pyramid there in, in Tula Hidalgo. And uh, I mean, that you can literally, if you take the camera up out of this cave and, and hold it up, uh, go about eight feet in the air, you, you can literally see the, the monument. I mean, it's not far away. And so this type of stuff here is at the 14 foot dig level. And it's absolutely insane seeing this on the walls and the, the type of iconography, the amount of pieces that they found that match the pieces that they've been selling to us for the last few years stuff that the government said was fake, the stuff that we could legally buy and sell because it wasn't real. This is what they're showing me in terms of where they're finding it and what they found. This is a complex that's absolutely, I, I mean, I have no words to really explain to you how ridiculous this is. There's been so many naysayers and so many people who have doubted the, the entire project in itself it's uh it's it's like you want to go tell these people that you're proud of what you found but at the same point knowing this is the truth it becomes far more complex and what we're seeing changes everything in, in the respect of, of god and religion and the amount of misinformation and deception that we constantly battle in our world it makes a lot of sense knowing this is the truth.